Hey all dear future aspirants, I Abhinav Negi welcome you all in this special episode of Daily Dose. And before going further into the short trick, let me all thank you all for your overwhelming support that you have given to the series. And let me tell you that whatever the points you have given us in the comment box, all those points are noted. And on videos on all those points will be coming in next two to three weeks. So on behalf of whole Baiju exam prep team, I thank you all for giving the wonderful support on this series. Okay, now I'll be telling you the short trick of strain energy today. Guys, every method has some limitation, area movement, double integration, Maclaws, but strain energy can be applied anywhere. If it is internal hinge, discontinuous, not same bending moment equation throughout the beam, frame, arches, beam, everywhere strain energy is useful, can be applied unless the temperature should be constant and material should be isotropic and support should not be sinking. It can be applied everywhere. So strain energy you can say is a universal method. Okay, and what trick I'll be telling you today guys, let me tell you that trick will reduce your time by more than, by more than 200 to 300%, your time will be reduced by half to one third. Okay, whatever I'll be telling you today. And that is, you can be used in objective, subjective, interview, everything. So whatever I'm telling you today, if you listen it properly, absorb it properly and implement it properly guys, then strain energy will be your favorite method. And whatever short trick I'll be telling you, this is some short trick. What is this? I'll be telling you. That has no limitation. It can be applied and everywhere. Okay, it can be applied everywhere, guys. Okay, it is not like that in certain problems. This is can be applied. Every question it can be applied. What you are doing till now? You are finding the U value, total strain energy. And after U, you, you are finding the U value. Okay, and then after u, you are finding the deflection as del u by del p partial differentiation and this deflection will be where the p load is acting and this deflection is in the direction of load. Okay, and theta is del u by del m. So actually you are finding the u first and after finding the u, you are finding deflection or theta. But our motive in slope and deflection chapter is only to find delta and theta. Who asked you u? Who asked you, you? Who asked you? You? So I'll be telling you certain short tricks from which no need to calculate you. Directly you will be getting delta and directly it will be getting theta. How to use this? It can be applied everywhere, no limitation. How to use this? For using this, there are some methods that is written here in English. Okay, no need to write this, no need to read this. Okay, I'll be explaining you everything here. Otherwise, you can take screenshot later on. Okay, so let me explain you all these points, whatever written here, how to use short trick, how to use short trick, you can see later on, otherwise I, I'm explaining here in these questions. Here, at the free end, deflection and theta is required. Okay, so the first step of our short trick is, wherever you want to find deflection, name that, name that load as Pn, and that Pn should not be acting anywhere else. That Pn should not be acting anywhere else. If suppose here and here both P are acting. So where the deflection is required, name it as a special name, Pn. At the end we'll make it P. At the end we'll make it P. Okay. Now, moving further. At uh, XX section, which is X distance from free end, the bending moment here, Mx I'm representing as bending moment, is minus Pn into X. Then deflection is twee, 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 mx is bending moment at x section minus pnx okay then whatever written here whatever written here differentiate with respect to pn whatever written here differentiate with respect to pn so it will be minus x dx upon ei now guys in childhood when guests are there i'm not eating biscuits and namkeen once they go out of the home i'm just thrashing into the biscuits now here also after the first steps guests are gone now you can be in your original now you can be in your original avatar. So now you can make it Pn is equal to P. Now after this step, you can make Pn is equal to P. Now P by EI are constant. X square integration will be X cube by 3. And putting the limits, it will be L cube by 3i like this. Okay. Now how to find slope? For slope, a movement should be acting where we want slope. Okay. And here it is M and yes, there is actually no moment acting. So at the end, we'll take it zero. Now here, what is bending moment at X, X section? It is, it is minus M and whatever written here, 
whatever written here differentiate with respect to mn into dx upon ei putting it from 0 to l now after this one mistake we have done that bending moment here is not only uh, minus mn it is minus mn and minus p into x also okay bending moment here from right hand side you see minus mn and minus px also differentiating with respect to mn it will be once we differentiate with respect to mn it will be minus 1 dx so now the guests are gone after the first step after the first step guests are gone make it it as 0 whatever the original value was 0 so from theta here it will be p by ei we can take it common x integration will be x square by 2 so it will be pl square by 2 ei and direction since it is comes positive direction will be same as this clockwise if it comes minus then direction will be reverse okay now suppose this take one more question so i want deflection at the free end okay sir now deflection at the free end wherever the deflection is required the first step put a load there pn and actually there was no load so at the end we can make it zero not at the end after the first step only so if i take a section xx here at x distance okay sir got it sir now where is the green color green color is here so delta is equal to mx is minus pnx mn is minus pnx at x distance into minus w w is the udl intensity x square by 2 whatever written here okay whatever written here differentiate with respect to pn so differentiate with respect to pn it is minus x dx upon ei just after the first step just after the first step come to original avatar that is actually the pn value is zero so delta is w by 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 not by 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 w by upon w by 2 ei okay sir got its x square x square integration will be x cube x cube x cube integration will be x cube integration will be x 4 by 4 putting the value 0 to l now putting the value 0 to l it will be w by 8 ei okay and that will be l 4 this is the deflection okay now these can be applied everywhere guys no limitation of this shortcut Otherwise, you are first calculating U, then doing del U by LP and that will take double or triple time. I hope you enjoyed this, guys. You can join me in Civil Bio Abhinav Sir, my Telegram group name. You can search on Telegram, Civil Bio Abhinav Sir. Please, guys, as always, please let me know in the comment box. Do enjoy this video. Is it benefit for you? And what are the topics that you require in the future? Thank you, guys. This is Abhinav Negi. I hope you enjoyed this. Signing off now as per today. We'll see you later. Thank you.